नमस्कार मंगेश मैथमेटिकल ट्रेडिंग में आप सबका स्वागत है आज एक फिर नए वीडियो के साथ आपके सामने पेश हो रहा हूँ टुडे वॉज ट्वेंटी सेकेंड ऑफ ऑगस्ट टू थाउजेंड ट्वेंटी थ्री तो लेट एस सी द ट्रेड्स ऑफ निफ्टी एंड बैंक निफ्टी टुडे आई एम गोइंग टू शेयर वन ऑफ माई सीक्रेट विथ ऑल ऑफ यू मैं आज ट्रेडिंग का एक सीक्रेट बताने वाला हूँ आपको ठीक है ये बैंक निफ्टी का चार्ट है दिस इज बैंक निफ्टी चार्ट एंड वी हैव डिसाइडेड फोर्टी फोर थाउजेंड वन हंड्रेड कॉल एंड पुट यू कैन सी दिस कॉल एंड पुट अगेन आई एम रिट्रेटिंग आई एम शेयरिंग वन ऑफ द सीक्रेट्स बहुत सारे लोगों ने कहा सर कुछ तो दीजिएगा हमें मेनी ऑफ यू सिंपली डिमांडेड दैट गिव अस समथिंग विच कैन हेल्प अस सो दिस इज अ कॉम्प्लीमेंट्री गिफ्ट फ्रॉम मी इट्स वेरी सिंपल इफ यू विल सी The open, it is said in Gujarati, bhav bhagwan che means open bhagwan che rather than bhav it should be open bhagwan che. Open is the king. What you need to do just add square root of open into open and subtract means what? Now just see, open is one seventy five point zero five. So get the square root of one seventy five point zero five. And that is thirteen point twenty three. Now add thirteen point twenty three into one seventy five point zero five, and what you get is one eighty eight point thirty. Draw a line. Now subtract the square root thirteen point twenty three minus one seventy five point zero five, and what you get is one sixty one point eight one. I have drawn a line over here. Now do the same thing here. Now, now input one ninety seven point eight five is the open. Its square root is fourteen point zero six. So add fourteen point zero six into one ninety seven point eight five. And what you get is two hundred and eleven point ninety one. Draw a line and then subtract fourteen point zero six from one ninety seven point eight five. And what you get is one eighty point zero one. That's all. And now, uh, ninety-seven point eight five. Let me calculate. Sorry, one eighty-three. Yeah, one eighty-three point seventy-eight. Correct. So these are the level. Now see, whenever see the beauty here, what has happened? The price took the support at this particular level. then you you can see it touched precisely over here when it touched the above line call was below below line this is above line of call this is above line of call this is below line of put this is below line of put it precisely took a resistance so that is why i said today's was a sellers market writers market people sell over here they covered here They sell over here. They cover here. Whichever you want to sell, you could have sold. Now see, while going up, they took a resistance here. So sell. Perfectly, they sold. Got a very good rally. Whenever the price went above, sell. And they got it. Okay. So now, so this was for bank Nifty. It was a sellers market. Now you could see. The price, whenever the both the price are below lower level. Now this is the scenario when both the price are below lower level. Okay, this is also below the lower level. This is also below the lower level, and the prices are very close. The prices are very close. So that is what I said. Okay, in Bank Nifty today it was a sellers market. Had you taken a A call near here, assuming that keeping a particular stop loss, then only that would have been possible. There is one more way to it. You just have to see two candles close, two candle close. They should be exclusive candle, and the close of the second one should be lowest of all. Close of now. This is the candle which is not touching the line that has closed below this, but second. Is not closing below this, and then high of this is broken means the negative impact is 
over at price from go up from here to here. Okay. Now see again, we need such a candle which is not touching the line. So this is the candle. And the next candle should close below low of this. But you can say this is a bullish pin bar. So this is not also showing the lowest low. Then the price touched the this thing. You could easily see there are few few more things now, just like what we call a white candle. White candle means previous candle high minus square root of i. So which you can find it over here. This was a white candle. This candle low minus square root of low. Below that, this is closed. That shows <coughs> that the price will go down from here. And so the price has gone up. Whenever the price reaches over here, you have to sell. Now I will show you the buy. How the buy could have, could have happened in Nifty. And for that, we'll go on Nifty 19,400 call. Now see, this is 19,400 call and put. Again, the same thing. Open plus square root of open, and that is what is this? And open minus square root of open is what is this? Okay. Here also, open plus square root of open and open minus square root of open. Now you see, whenever this comes below, this goes up. This goes up. See, there has to be a equal moment if this is breaking above the upper line this should go this ideally should break below the lower line this is breaking above but this is not breaking below itself shows this price is going to come down and this will go up very simple and from there precisely the price went up the, the price came down now, whenever it took support, now just see the same thing is reversed. Here, that has gone above upper line. This is resisting to go below lower line. So, that is why you get your risk to reward ratio will be maximum at this particular level. Why? Because the moment one candle gets closed, you will trigger the stop loss. But risk to reward ratio, see, had you bought it at 50 rupees, that went to 65. I mean, that was playing simply between this level and this level. Now, you short it here. See, price reached the upper level. This price low to precisely touch the lower level. It's taking support. It's taking resistance. It moved upward. You just see this. It moved upward. And you can use volume also if you want. You can use volume. And then the picture will be more clear. Just see the volume part. Okay. Now what you could see, see in volume is volume has increased. See, twice. As I told you, 1.349 million and here 2.93 million. So volume has increased twice. You can use the same logic over here. Volume cannot be manipulated. So that is why this stands true. So, so see here also, here the volume was 1.46. Here the volume is 2.75. Almost double. So on volume basis, this will go up. It again took a support and then finally put went up. So see, call took a support, went up, then again took a support. <clears throat> and now see when it is taking support at this level, unlike this level, here volume is not increasing. Here negative volume has increased, not the positive volume. See this precise candle. And here the positive volume has increased from 70 to 84, 20% you could get. Today's was basically a narrow range market. And this is how one can trade in narrow range market. The importance is open plus square root of say, uh, square root of the open and open minus square root of the open. I think this will improve your trading quite a lot. Thank you. Thanks for watching.